What up, guys? Kelly Burke, KRB Fitness and ladies. Instructional leg day video. Okay, I'm going to record this at Metroflex Arlington, so it's going to be extremely loud in there. So what I plan on doing during the video is um, coming back outside and, and narrating um, each exercise in comparison to uh, narrating while um, I'm working out like the previous um, instructional videos. Um, so we'll see how this goes. Hopefully it goes well. And um, just plan on killing these legs, man. Somebody asked me in one of the videos before, um, how's my how's my knee doing since uh, the injury on the 500 pound squat uh, fail day? And um, it is definitely not 100%. Um, I can do all my other leg exercises and feel you know minimal pain, but on my squats, um, it still hurts. And uh, not so much while I'm squatting, but after I squat, I mean it's um, it's pretty bad. So I've been laying off of the squats. Um, if you saw the leg day video, the train I did, uh, I actually squatted really light on the Smith machine on that video. And, um, yeah, after that day, it hurt too. So, I don't know. I'm going to see how it feels today. And if it feels okay, I might squat. If not, um, I've been laying away from the squats. been doing stuff like hack squats and stuff. haven't been doing anything like barbell squats or free squats. So, I do stuff that, um, like super squat or squat machine or, you know, um, the hack squat. I do stuff like that that incorporates... Um, uh, the squat the same way, just not on the uh, the free squats. And so, um, I know my legs have taken a toll from that, but at the same time, um, I still been training them hard. So, haven't really lost anything. Um, and uh, so, we'll see, man. So, let's jump into it and uh, hope you enjoy the ride. All right, guys. So we jumping off on the uh, leg extensions, and uh, I don't count the uh, number of sets I'm doing. So I'm gonna just count the reps. So I'm um, doing around 30 reps, maybe 40 if I'm feeling good. If I go a little heavier, I'll drop it back down to like 10, I mean 20 rep range. And uh, the main thing I like to focus on on leg extensions is just getting my legs all the way up um, past that point of um, medial and go higher than that. So it's easy to do because it's old and raggedy. And so it clicks when you go all the way up to the top. It hit the weight, hits the top. So it lets me know I'm getting high enough. All right. so. Um, on this set that you're about to see, I'm going to be hitting 20 reps, making sure I'm getting a good squeeze at the top and flexing that muscle, and then contracting it, and then bringing it back down. Let's go. Alright guys, moving on to the hack squats, uh, four or five sets here, I'm going to record my set with three wheels, I'm going to go up a little heavier today, but I ain't going to record that, <laughs> in case it get a little ugly, <laughs> but uh, basically what I like to do here is, make sure you're going all over what I like to do, I like to go all the way down, uh, make comparison doing a, a free squat, barbell squat, and uh, try to sink down in the bottom, explode up, and uh, at the bottom it's like a, a slight squeeze, you might not be able to see it because I, I, I do it pretty quick, but it's going to be a slight squeeze or flex in the quad and then I explode back up. So I'm not going to go all the way up and stop them unless I get, unless they start hurting too bad, I like to keep that constant tension. So it's going to be a constant flow, down all the way, up, explode, and back, right back down. So um, yeah, that's how I do it, man. All right? Tall man bodybuilding, let's go.
right, guys, onto the leg press. Um, normally on leg press, I do uh, sets of 20. So about five or six of 20, increasing the weight each set. Uh, today, I'm just working on uh, trying to lift some heavy weights. So uh, the set you're about to see, I'm gonna do 10 wheels and I'm keeping all my reps at 10 today. Uh, so cause I, I plan on getting uh, a little heavier than that for the last set. So uh, I'll probably go up to 12, 12 wheels or so. so. possible um, letting a small sit at the bottom and then uh, exploding it back up um, so I'm trying to work on making these legs round so if you when when, when, uh, when they record look at my feet you notice my feet are not going to be out really wide I'm trying to bring my feet in uh, a little bit more tapered and uh, try to keep my knees um, parallel uh, to my feet and um, just to focus more on the quad man trying to see um, if I can get more development out of that, and it doesn't hurt my knee as much. I'm a rap, but um, it really doesn't hurt my knee when I do them that way, so let's go. Right, guys on to the last quad exercise we're only doing four and then we'll do uh, two for hamstrings we're going to superset those um, we're doing a vertical uh, leg press so that's the one that you're uh, lying on the floor of course um, if you don't have this in your gym you can always do it on a spin machine and lay on the floor it's the same concept man but it works great for putting um, extra emphasis on that quad and um, it's just all quad man so um, I'm not going to be going really heavy on, on the weight in the video because I got other people working out with me and I don't feel like Switching all this weight around, so um, I got a little weight on there right now for uh, the reps that I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do 20 reps here, and that's what I usually do on the vertical. Um, four sets of 20, and um, the key to it is, is you don't need to um, uh, worry about speed on it. Even though sometimes I do, trying to get through the, the set, just want to take your time on it and really focus on trying to grow that quad. Take your time with it, down, up, um, fully extended out. Not to where your knee is bent though, of course, um, all the way out. I mean, your knee is always straight. Keep that knee bent and then bring it all the way back down as deep as you can. Just try to get deeper um, every uh, rep. All right, let's go. guys on to the last exercises uh, time for the hamstrings <laughs> so we're gonna do lion hamstring curls and standing hamstring curls and work them together both of them 10 reps not, I don't do a lot of high reps dog in the background video I don't do a lot of high reps anymore for uh, hamstrings uh, especially not during off season uh, when I get ready for prep I'll start uh, doing high reps because I'm trying to build that size on them and I want them to pop out so I've been going uh, heavier weight you uh, explode up hit yourself in the butt squeeze it release it all right that's how you do hamstrings all right none of that halfway rep where you're just going up and it's more for feel like it's more constant tension you get it's going to hurt work doing it this way okay 
watch Tom Platt's leg training videos and you'll see his concept on the hamstrings and how he did them. Okay, and this is where I got it from. So um, it's more effective, hurts worse, and it was harder to go higher up doing it as well. So, all right, let's go. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, remember to keep training hard, man. As you can see, um, I take my leg training very serious because, uh, you know, that's just a body part that I need to bring up a lot. So um, eventually I want my legs to be very dominant on stage and uh, I want it to be evident through, evident through my training. So, you know, really take the time out and put the work into training legs. I definitely need them to grow. Uh, with me being six foot three, you know, I want some wheels of steel. I want those boys to stand out from the front and the side um, and the back when I'm doing all my poses. I want them, them to be very impressive. So um, I train as such. And, you know, I've made great development, um, but, um, you know, I still want to put more size on them. So you guys keep training hard. I hope this video helped you. I hope the series is helping you, man. And uh, thanks for everybody that's been rolling with me so far. Uh, remember to subscribe to KRB Fitness, like the video, comment, and share it, and shop my tees at krbapparel.bigcartel.com.com. <laughs> Kelly Burke, KRB Fitness, I'll holler at you. Blah! Oh, uh -huh.